everyday new technologies being introduced to the world, and sometimes there are things you never knew you needed until they appear. That's the case with smart water bottles. I first heard of one called Drink Up, which can encourage you to drink more water, but now there's another level of smart water bottle to tell you about. It's a water bottle you can listen to. I'm Erin for Best Buy Canada's blog, and I recently got hooked up with this smart speaker water bottle combination from a company called Aquio and home gadget purveyor iHome. They've partnered to bring the first smart speaker water bottle to the market. We're going to take a look at how it works and whether it's worth getting. The Aquio bottle is a 16-ounce double-walled stainless steel water bottle combined with a Bluetooth speaker that's removable. The speaker screws into the bottom of the bottle so it's more easily portable. The bottle itself is BPA-free and promises to keep drinks hot up to 14 hours or cold for up to 24. Bringing your Aquio along lets you bring a small-sized speaker wherever you go. You can leave it attached to the water bottle if you're working out or remove it and take it anywhere. The speaker houses a rechargeable battery and it's got a nice fabric wrap on it, plus it comes in some cool colors. The bottle itself has a twist-off lid with a carry loop and sports a wide mouth, making it easy to add ice cubes and easy to clean. It's also sized to fit a cup holder, which is pretty convenient. Aquio says you can get up to six hours of playtime on a single charge. The speaker's operation is actually quite simple. There's really only three buttons on here that you're gonna to have to learn how to use. There's a play pause button on the front and a power button and a Bluetooth pairing on either side of the flap here at the back. You can push the Bluetooth button to pair it, goes into pairing mode, then you'll look in the Bluetooth menu on your phone or device to find the Aquio speaker. Once you connect it to your device via Bluetooth, you can use the play pause button here to perform a bunch of different functions depending on how you're using the speaker. If you're using it as a speaker, phone just press once to answer or to end a call you can long press to decline a call when you're listening to music you can press the play pause button here once to play or pause your music double press to skip a track and triple press to go back to the previous track or to start the current track over again the Aquio bottle is IP67 rated, meaning the speaker is waterproof and sandproof and generally weather resistant. The speaker can end up immersed in water without damage, meaning it's great for the lake or a rainy bike ride. When it comes to the speaker's power, it's got five watts. It's also got something called digital echo cancellation, which is supposed to make it sound better. It's got uh, audio caller ID if someone rings you while you're listening to music. And it also comes wrapped in what Aquio calls designer acoustic fabric. But let's get to the stuff you guys really want to know. How does it sound? The Aquio speaker actually sounds good. It's reasonably powerful for its size, and it was easily filling up our living room area. Now, not surprisingly, there's not a whole lot of bass in this speaker, and the overall sound can lean heavily towards the high end. Audiophiles will probably find a lot to be desired with this speaker, but for most of the rest of us who just need portable sound, it does the job nicely. Overall, this bottle is a pretty fun idea. It's handy for going on things like a bike ride or a hike. The design is definitely beautiful, it's fashionable and handy, and it's actually pretty affordable for a speaker. Well, I guess it's affordable for a speaker if you look at it that way, but it also could be considered a very expensive water bottle. Um, I also like the fact that the design is waterproof. In terms of sound quality, I'd say the Aquio is generally unremarkable in terms of quality compared to something like a Sony speaker, for example. So if you're looking for high quality audio and powerful bass, this is not going to cut it. This is more about convenience. But even so, overall, it sounds really good and it doesn't distort at higher volumes. If there was something missing from the speaker, for me, it's the lack of on-device volume controls. So while you can hit play or pause on this speaker, as we talked about, there's no volume buttons, meaning you're going to need to keep your phone handy and use that to adjust the levels. I'd also say the water bottle size here, once it's off the speaker base, is actually pretty small. It only holds about 16 ounces or two cups. And while that might get you through a short workout or a quick walk, this is probably not enough for you on a longer hike. Even so, overall, this is a pretty handy gadget that works great for the price. The biggest question you'll have to ask yourself is, is it something you want or is it something you need? If you want to read more about it, head over to blog.bestbuy.ca where we've posted a full write-up and you can ask us any questions you have either there or, of course, here on the YouTube channel. If you liked this video and found it helpful, please hit that like button and consider subscribing. Since it does help us keep making more videos, we hope everyone out there can watch and enjoy.
I'm Erin. Catch me on Twitter or Instagram. Until the next time, you can find me at ErinLYYC.